Welcome back. Well, today marks the end of an era here at KCAL News. Investigative icon David Goldstein is leaving us after nearly 35 years and a legendary career. David Goldstein, this is your life. This guy is like a thug. You suck, by the way. I don't give a what you do. Get your muck away from me. Before David made a name for himself in Los Angeles. Hey, I'm David Goldstein, a reporter with Channel 2 News. Goldstein. He began perfecting his SIG out in Harrisburg, Virginia. David Gordon reporting. <laughs> Wait a second. I forgot what my opening line was. <laughs> win. I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> Next, Jacksonville, Florida. Then, Miami. Drop dead? Yeah. Why is that, sir? Where he developed a thick skin for his next gig, New York City. Oh, what's up, dude? How you doing? And with our hidden camera, here's how easy it is to buy drugs on Wall Street. Yep, that's Goldie, undercover, getting a shoe shine. You know anyone around selling any coke right now? David's played a crucial role at CBS2 and KCAL 9 News, covering LA's biggest stories, like the LA riots. They're all thankful the fire department has arrived. OJ, are you a suspect? The OJ trial. Mr. David, I told you before he wasn't going to say anything. I know you got to ask a question, but give us a break. Officials say this was the area that was ground zero for the Scud missile. And reporting on the Gulf War from Jerusalem. Another witness. While some are willing to answer his questions. He said, hey, man, the lady's walking right up the street. Others, not so much. You're not the police, so you. You brought up being frugal. Let me just talk to you one second. I can't, man. I got nothing to say to you. You got nothing to say? Nothing. How come? It's not true. None of it's true. None of it's true? Nope. I got video, man. We got you going into the strip club. Mr. Baker, you left your wine over here, sir. Mr. Baker, you left your 12 bottles of wine. Well, you've got to give it to David. No He's the reporter who never backs down. Don't stand in front of my camera, sir. Don't, don't put your hand on the camera. Hey, 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 don't put your hand on the camera. It was not a party. It was a professional promotional event. It was a party. It was a professional promotional event. It's not a yacht. It is about, a yacht. It's about... Why won't you show it to us? I'll show it to you right no, now. No, no, wait a minute. I'll I asked you right no, now, sir. No, I'll show... Excuse me. Listen, we're going you want to take my phone, Governor? Yeah. And when they see Goldie coming... <laughs> it's time to get moving. Well, what about the vets? Come on, Jason. We've been grateful to have an investigative reporter like David Goldstein on our team, willing to do what it takes to expose fraud and corruption. And when it comes to safeguarding taxpayer dollars, $10.2 million, no one's been more vigilant. So you're getting a manicure using the LAPD BMW. David has been a friend of mine for 35 years. I know I speak for the entire KCAL News team as we bid him a fond farewell. <laughs> that was your life. It was. That in was three minutes. Your life yeah. in three minutes. <laughs> you know, Goldie. Um, I just want to point out there's so many things that you have done for this city, and whether you know it or not, I mean, people say, "Oh, that David Goldstein," but at the same time, they are so grateful because you were the one who would go out and not only ex expose corruption, fraud, get information that helped the taxpayers of this city. I remember that red light camera investigation you did. David Goldstein made it, uh, folks, where there are no more red light cameras in, in Los city, Angeles. Tell us about that. You changed well, that. Uh, you know, they were making a lot of money off red light tickets mm -hmm. and people were complaining about it. And the city always said, oh, they make the streets safer. So we did an analysis of accidents on the corners where they had red light cameras for six months or eight months before the cameras were installed to six or eight months after the cameras and showed there were actually more accidents after the cameras were installed because people saw that there was a camera, they would they slam got, in their yeah. brakes and the person behind them didn't expect them to slam in their brakes. So it's, it's little things like that that I'm proud of, Big that things. the city uh, took those away. Uh, pet stores, we did an investigation mm, yeah, on how they were abusing uh, dogs and cats in some pet stores. Um, and then they banned, uh, the city banned the sale of dogs and cats in pet stores, uh, partly due to our investigation. So it's things like that and, and, and all of these 
pretty much came from tips from viewers who saw something and said, hey, this isn't right. Let me call and let me email them. And you know, we were able to do some of those investigations. I, I think I told you this, that, that one of the most frightening things for me is when you showed up in Israel during the Gulf War in the 90s and he had on a, ga a gas mask. That made my heart stop. Yeah. I was really scared for you. But you were in, intrepid, incredulous. David, when we met 30... 34 years ago. Did you expect that you'd be here now? Of course not. No <laughs> one in this business, uh, or I don't know, any business you expect to yeah. be there so long. I mean, it went like a flash. You it know, does. I, now that I say that, and I'm looking you know, and I'm, at your beautiful wife, Dorothy, and your, your, your son, Nash, over, over there, and I just remember when, um, when you got married, your wedding, when Nash was born, but we used to have a lot of fun together. We still will. We but. still do. And, and people, and, and we use the term family a lot in this business, but truly, we have been the best of friends for my 34 brother, years. My brother. Ben. And I'm going to miss seeing you every day. I'm going to miss seeing you coming in the doors. I'm going to miss seeing you too. Sitting on the set and just all those little, any question I had or concern, I talked to you and get wisdom, and you really were like a brother I'm going to miss me. seeing you coming in the newsroom every day, and, but we still... You know, we're going out to dinner after the <laughs> six o'clock broadcast. Yeah. We're still going to see each other. We will. And, we uh, will. But you it's... know, we talk about retirement, and I'm going <sighs> to set it straight. I, I'm not calling it a retirement. I'm going to take a break for a while and okay. uh, see uh, if there's a ne next chapter out there. Okay. If there, anybody can do it, you can, because you're just too young. <laughs> And I'll go with that. <laughs> <laughs> well, folks, for more on David Goldstein's incredible career, be sure to watch our streaming special tonight at 6.30 on CBS News Los Angeles. There'll be more laughs, more tears. You can download the CBS News app on any device or check us out on Pluto TV.